Sony Computer Entertainment, the XS. Huh. This looks uh, suspicious. Huh. Uh, okay, this is weird. Oh, PlayStation, huh? I my Sony Computer Entertainment America, SCA, short term, of course. Derp. <laughs> Computer Entertainment America presents Universal Interactive Studios at their website as well. I think the credits gave away. What the heck? Insomniac Games. And yeah, Ribbit to use too, sir. Oh! You got, you got owned, sir. Well, look who it is, guys. It's Spyro the Dragon. Yes, guys, welcome to my new Let's Play. This is Spyro the Dragon. This is my new Let's Play for New Year's Day of 2012. And I have played this before, as you see. But we are going to get a new game. So, folks. In the world of dragons. Amazing, isn't it? Oh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds, or is it six, for a dragon's age? We now have 12,000 treasure, or is it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Gnorth character? Now, I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. I'll take that question. Nasty Gnorth is a simple creature. It's been contained in a remote world that is no threat to the Dragon Keeper. No threat! Besides, <laughs> a ugly bad uh -oh. dozen! Oh crap, whoa, what the? Hey, what gives? Looks like I got some things to do. Yeah. Yeah, we got a little work to do here, Spyro. So, the adventure begins. Alright, so here we are, guys. So let's go over to basics here. Let's uh, check our inventory here. Okay, so right here, we are in the Arison world. This is the home world. The treasure chest here, you see, this is how many gems we need to collect. We need to collect 100 gems to collect all the gems in this area. There are four dragons we need to save. In total, there are 80 dragons we need to save. Okay, so this is our first world we're in. Top left, top left corner here, we have our treasure we collect. On the top, in the middle on the top here, by the pause sign, we have the dragons we need to save. And then on the top right, we have our lives. Alright, so, uh, okay, so the L2 and R2, you can uh, move the camera around. L1 and L2, you can do this. Circle to breathe fire. Triangle, uh, you can look around. X to jump and then press X again to, to glide. Uh, I don't want to wanna collect any of this stuff yet because I want to talk to this dragon first. And square you can also charge. Pretty simple, huh? And the control stick or D-pad of course you can uh, move. And our dragonfly here is also known as Sparks. He is your health bar. We'll get into that later, but first We'll save the source dragon here. This is Nestor. Thank you for releasing this fire. Free ten dragons in the Arthas of World. Then find the balloons. He'll transport you to the next world. What about Nasty Nord? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. Oh, come on. Can we just take on Nasty Nord right now? But then we do that. The LP will be over one episode. <laughs> I guess that makes sense. So, if you go on here, you can save your game, replay that dragon again, or just go ahead and continue. But we're going to go ahead and save anyway. Eh, because I feel like it. Okay. So let's go Let's go and kill some enemies. This guy. I'm going to get some gems. I'm not done with you. See, I got to attack like three times. Okay, now the value of the gems. The red ones are worth one. You get green ones that are worth two. Green that are worth three. Uh, oh, uh, red are worth one. Green are worth two. Blues are worth five. 
Gold or a 10. Purple, which are the rarest to get. They are worth 25. And they are the hardest to get, too. Okay, so now we're saving Delvin. Where's Nasty Nork? I'll torch him. Keep your horns on, Spyro. You have much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Um. His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. Yep. Sparks is going to be a pretty much our health here. He is going to be our big help. So, real quick, if you do this, here, 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 and here, voila, you unlock a new world. This is Sunny Flight. One of the portals we'll be going to uh, much later on. And, uh, ow, darn it. Okay, well, there's a new car you can show off. And now with Sparks. He's now blue for taking damage. Whoa. Ah, we're gonna go play in the maze, huh? Okay. I'll come play. Bam! Oh, there's a blue gym we got. Alright, nice. Uh, treasure chest, you can easy blow these up. That little silver statue we collected too is a extra life. Right here we have another portal that'll take us to Dark Hollow. We'll do that later as well. Come here, you. Eh, you got burn. So, the voice acting in this game, I'll be, it'll be very limited in this one. <laughs> Let's go talk to the balloonist real quick. This is Marco. If you prove your worth by rescuing ten... If you prove your worth by rescuing ten dragons, you may use this balloon to fly to a new world. Alright, so sometimes you'll have to do a little requirement in order to move on to the next world. But sometimes, though, you can just go ahead and go to the next world without even completing this area. But again, guys, this will be a 100% run. So you need to get up on the hill. You need to get up on that hill pretty high to reach uh, that uh, little area. Okay, we got some more treasure to collect. Yeah, yeah. There's like a hundred treasure here to collect. So, oh yes, did I show this? Okay, it hasn't come up. It hasn't come up yet, so we're still waiting on that. There's another thing we need to collect here too, but I'll go over that later. Now we'll save Argus. Cool crap! Do that again. The artisan's boss is through a portal in the Dragon Mount, but you are not yet ready, Spyro. First, you must complete one of the other artisan lands. So yeah, here we need a. Uh... Not only that, but we also need to save uh, a few dragons as well, I, I believe, in order to unlock that area. So yes, every er every homeworld will also have a boss that you have to take on as well. Okay, where did he just go? Oh, there you are. Coward. Don't worry about these enemies at all. These guys won't even attack you. We only got 26 to go. Um... I show that off yet? No. I'll show it off later. Okay, so let's go ahead through here, this area. And make sure to check everywhere, because you can sometimes may miss some of the treasure. Here's our last dragon for this world, Thomas. Hey Spyro, press the jump button twice to glide. And and don't be afraid. Afraid? Of what? Falling from high mountain peaks, plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. You sure a big help. I'm afraid of heights. Thanks a lot. <laughs> yeah, you gotta be freaked out. Uh, that's why I don't ride roller coasters. But again, what do the roller coasters have to do with this? Uh, do a spiral? Good question. That's the fun. Okay, and apparently somebody commenting on Skype while I'm trying to record here. Ugh. I mean, it's important, fine, but... You know, I'm recording here. When I say do not disturb, I mean do not disturb. Ay caramba. But if it's LP or League related stuff, then that's not a problem to me. One sec, guys. Okay, guys, we're back. Uh, got a comment from one, my, one of the members of LP or League, one of the co the, the co owner of the League. Uh, Wanted to thank me for a. Uh, apparently, we had a troll spamming comments on our channel, and, uh. Well. 
It's a good thing I found it before everybody would freak out about it. So yeah, thank goodness for that. And you know, that's the one thing I hate about it is trolls. And see that we already got our hard gems here. Trolls are just annoying. They always want attention. So again, I tell you people, just ignore the trolls. Nobody cares. All they do is want his attention, so don't bother. So anyway, now that we're done with the, with the whole world here. We have all her gems and four gems, and we got 2% done. Woo! Only 90% to go. So let's begin Dark Hollow. That's a lot of red gems. Also, there's some greens too. Okay, so here we are in Dark Hollow, our first world. Okay, now enemies with the metal shields. Fire attacks from a war, but charge will. And if you kill like these things or anything, like frogs or sheep, then um, that's uh, where you can get uh, butterflies or sparks to get uh, health. This here. Can't do anything to it because it has a lock. So we need a key for it. Big enemies that you take on as well. See, so watch. Fire doesn't work. The charge will. Uh, big guys as well. You can't charge them either. You gotta flame them. Oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course, they wouldn't bother me if I hear the hint. Metal, armor, and firewood. But a charge attack will take care of Thank you, though. I already mentioned it. But I do appreciate the assistance. Well, they keep their defenses down by not putting up their metal shield ring, and then, uh, you can attack them. Okay, so here's another one. We got a big guy here. Big metal armor. So you think, oh, we can't attack him, but his body is exposed. Yeah, but this guy, though, you gotta be real quick. I don't think we're done yet. We have more. Alright, and now let's go meet Oslin. No, because I know your secret now. <laughs> uh, everybody that watches this will know your secret, man. But we'll keep it a secret for you. Anyway, we got our key now. We got the key to unlock, so now we can go ahead and open up the chest and see what's inside. What we get as a little prize for doing this. Whoops. I thought I missed one. Alright, actually, I think I should go on over how much treasure and everything is here. And our hard treasure again, and there are only three dragons to save in this area. So yeah, one more dragon to go. Now today, since this is my new Let's Play of this game, I'm, I'm going to do two videos. But starting from now on, throughout the rest of the, uh, the rest of this LP, I'm only going to do uh, one video a day. For like maybe 15 to 20 minutes, depending on how much progress we get through the game. If I don't finish through like one certain world, I'll make another video, a uh, short video of it. To continue the progress, and then we'll uh, go on from there. Yeah, you hide from your big, from your uh, big boy there, big daddy. Yeah, you got nothing on me. Alright, so far so good. Oh, do I miss a gem? Oh, I even missed more back there. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I do remember where all the stuff is at. It's just in the far, in the further on, uh, further on in the rest of this, of, the, of this game, it's gonna be a little tricky for me to remember where everything is at. In extra life, I do have one more thing to show off as well with that. He's saying one more thing a lot. I hope a Jackie Chan, in the Jackie Chan series. One more thing. Big enemies like this get off with a club that cannot be charged, but a quick flame that should. Be you're a poet, and I sure know it. You 
sounded kind of like a poet to me. And crap, I forgot to go back and get that uh, treasure chest. Mark. Dosh it all and all that. What? Yeah, this world's really short, so this is able to get back here. Okay, so here we go, and... I love when that happens. And, ladies and gentlemen, we have collected all the treasure in Dark Hollows, and saved all three dragons as well. Now, without further ado... Let's get the heck out of here, folks. Whee! Oh yeah, we got one wheezy blue gem again. Outrageous. Okay. Another thing to solve, uh, these enemies will spawn back and now look what you get. For killing enemies this time, you get uh, a little orbs. You get these shiny little orbs here. Ooh, shiny. Peanut Butter Gaming was watching, he was watching this, he'd be saying, ooh, shiny. Okay, so next where I want to head to is Stone Hill. Pretty nice place. Yeah, it's really nice. 